Welcome back to Ones to Watch on Footy Accumulators, powered by our friends at Football Index, the stock market for buying and selling shares in football players. I'm joined, as always, by Sir Alan McEnany. Ones to Watch in 2020. Yeah, that's what we want to do, try and help you out. Should we get yep. stuck in then? Yes. Who's number one? Uh, you know my favourite, oh. Romelu Lukaku. You're a fan of this guy. Everton did brilliant. Was it 80 million? Um, they were happy to sell him to Manchester United. And as well as he did at Manchester United, there's. I think now, though, the situation with Rashford being injured and being out for two to three months, mm. could they not. It's Lukaku that's left. There's a couple of players have gone, um, and most of them could, could slip back straight back into the team. Um, listen, he's. I think he. The goal and his touch wasn't good enough. And he went through a spell of five or six games that it, nothing was going for him, and then he would come back in and he'd be fantastic, and people would change their mind. I think he's always going to be like that. But there'll still be plenty of people looking at Lukaku. And again, of course, like, oh, that's a good idea. Media dividends as well, which we know pay out. So. I'm a huge thing on media. It's not just performance wise, it's about the media side of things as well on Football Index. And of course, with him being involved in 2020. Uh, sorry, with the, the Euros, with Belgium, with scoring goals for them and scoring goals for Inter Milan. He's always going to be sought after, he is, Lukaku. He's, he certainly is. Well, he's been... They come, but I'm sure there is. Well, I mean, that's pretty impressive if he's so good now and you think there's still more to come. Yeah, Do you yeah. see him starting <coughs> in the England squad? Well, again, we look at formations and how we think why he might be one to watch on Football Index, mm -hmm. which is for the simple reason I think England will probably can play there, no problem for England, Oxley Chamberlain. Absolutely. Well, you said, you know, it's like he's got a little bit more to give. Where mm. can you see uh, room for improvement? All in 14 games this season. Yeah, you know, for Chelsea, that's not good enough. For Manchester United, it's not good enough. For Liverpool, it's not good enough. I'd be looking for him to get me at least eight to ten goals a season. At least Oxley Chamberlain. He's powerful. He's got a good shot and he normally knows where the goal is. So give me some more goals. So that was the only thing. The other thing, of course, is.